Hello everyone, now let us discuss about some of the mock questions from CPC exam from anatomy and medical terminology. First of all, coming to questions from medical terminology. Coming to the first question, a woman who has given birth four times is called. A woman who has given birth four times is called as quadri para. Quadri para indicates a woman who has given birth four times. Coming to the next question, stomato. The word stomato refers to mouth. The correct option is option C. It is mainly used in some of the surgical terminologies such as stomatoplasty. Coming to the next question, which of these suffixes means to rupture? The suffix rexus. As in the case, aminorexis. Aminorexis is nothing but rupture of the amniotic sac. Rexis indicates to rupture. So the correct, correct answer is option D. What does TSH means? The next question is what does TSH means? TSH mainly indicates thyroid stimulating harm. So option B is the correct answer. Next, coming to questions from anatomy. Which ligament connects the femur to the tibia in the back of the knee? Remember, there is a popliteal fossa behind the knee, which mainly anchors femur and tibia. So, the ligament which connects the femur to libia in the back of the knee is popliteal. Option B is the correct answer. Next question, the opaque white outer part of the eyeball is called sclera. The opaque white outer part of the eyeball is called as sclera. Here you can see in the diagram, the wider part, the white part, opaque white outer part of the eyeball is called as sclera. Option C is the correct answer. Which type of hernia can be corrected by manipulation? Next question is, which type of hernia can be corrected by manipulation? In majority of the cases, reducible hernias can be corrected by manipulation. So, option B is the correct answer. Incarcerated means irreducible. So, that cannot be corrected by manipulation. Only reducible hernias can be corrected by manipulation. Next question, which of the following is found in both male and female bodies? The option is, option B is the correct answer, urethra. Urethra can be found in both male and female bodies. Whereas, labia majora is majorly present in females. Whereas, tunica vaginalis and corpus spongiosum is present in males. So, urethra is the part or organ which is found in both male and female bodies among the given options. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe for further videos on medical coding and CPC training.